today is my gender reveal. It's June 6, 2020. I've been a walking heartache. I've made a mess of me. The person that I've been lately ain't who I want to be. But you stay here right beside me and watch as the storm blows through. And I need you. Scott gave me you for the ups and downs. It was in March, I want to say. Um, I kind of just knew since, you know, I just was like, something's just not right. Um, so I took a pregnancy test. Um, I just didn't know how to feel about it at the moment. Um, it's just really like shocking and surprising. Um, but of course, like I'm happy, I'm, I'm excited. Um, ever since I found out, I think I've been excited. It's just all of it's coming together now, so it's more exciting. <laughs> My sister is the only one that really knows, um, but I have a, a feeling it's a boy, which I, I want. Like, I'm praying it's a boy. Um, actually, I really don't care, but I say it's going to be a girl. Boy. Boy. <laughs> I think it's going to be a girl. I think it's going to be a boy. I think it's going to be a girl. Boy. Team boy. I say a girl. But we need, uh, she's so small. We need more time to look at her stomach. Mm -hmm. In my gut, I really do feel like it's a boy. <laughs> so I had surprised my mom and my stepdad with little gift boxes. Because um, I would known my mom was, they were ready. They were always like talking about it. And I felt this before she told us. I felt it. They'd be like, I'm, I'm ready whenever you're ready. And as I could feel that you need, you need a baby in the house. Um, so I knew she was going to be like really excited, so I wanted to surprise her. It was right, I think it was Easter weekend, and I gave her a little gift box, and it had the ultrasound. And um, I made her a little baby shirt that said, I can't wait to meet you, Grandma. And I'll never forget that day when she told me it was the worst day ever for me. Worst day. And when she she came in, I was already crying because I was having a bad day. And then she shared the news and I just cried more. And this time I was just, I'm happy. I'm so, I'm just so happy for her. And they were so happy. My mom cried, we cried. It was like so emotional. She was so happy and yeah, they're excited. Well, <laughs> I found out through Facebook, which wasn't really the way I wanted to find liar. out. But... He's a liar! <laughs> no, because and then I I made her come to my house. I said, babe, if you got something to tell me, you gotta come over to my house and I wanna hear it from you. I, I, am, I am proud of you, baby. And, um, I pr I'm proud of everything you've done and everything you've accomplished. I mean, I'm proud to tell everybody who you are and what you've done. And I'm excited to see how you enter this new journey that you're on. We're excited. <laughs> I'm the grandma. My name is Sylvia Bustillos. I was the last one to find out, and that was by phone. <laughs> Nobody's got a grandma, though. <laughs> my thoughts, she's my baby. She's small. It's done. Happy for her, but uh, inside me, I want, I'm going to see the struggles. It's not easy. It's not. Gorgeous, we're behind you. Uh, it's not gonna be easy, but Cause God you got gave us. me you for the ups and downs. <laughs> God gave me you for the days of
Like I love you and I'm excited to see like what you'll teach me and this new journey and I think like excited doesn't like even begin to explain. Can't wait till we go trick or treat. We already <laughs> love you. He's the, the little one of the Montoya family. He's gonna be real spoiled. I'm just static and can't wait to meet the baby. Hmm, what message? <sighs> just that I love you very much. Um, <laughs> I love your mom very much. Your mom was my first baby girl. And that's the only reason why it kind of makes me sad because she, was, she is my first baby. And I love all my girls. They're my, they're my favorite over the boys. <laughs> Thank you for all your support. It means so much to me. I'm just super excited for everybody that is here and supporting me and I'm so thankful that I have all of them to go to if I ever need anything.